Hi, yarn bees. It's me. Yes, I know it's been <coughs> a few days since. <laughs> since I've been on video, um, it's been it's been a couple days, man. It's uh, yeah. I'm oops, sorry. <laughs> World's tilting. Oh. Um, I'm I've got one painkiller left. And I've been fighting with my surgeon and my doctor trying to get some more pain meds. My surgeon won't give me any more. Um, so anyways, my surgeon won't give me any more pills because they're narcotic. Uh, and so she said, you have to go to your doctor and get the prescription filled. Well, my doctor won't fill the prescription over the phone because they're opioid narcotics so I have to go to the office um I haven't left the house since the surgery and you know we got the stairs in the front of the house and blah 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 and I can't get down and all this so I made an appointment for tomorrow morning I'm going to butt scoot down the stairs <laughs> Boots go <laughs> and uh, and get to the van and get into it and get to my doctor. Um, <clears throat> I'm hoping it's all going to work, especially when I'm not going to have any pain meds in my system. It's going to suck and it's going to suck bad and I'm going to be really pissed if he doesn't give me anything. So anyway, as you can hear... I have a guest at the house now. My youngin showed up yesterday. Yes. And she is going to be helping me through the holiday. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> she just got out of the shower, so <laughs> she's got turban on her head and she's What do you mean? This is how I go it all the time. <laughs> So, anyways, it's awesome. You know. So dumb. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, they say laughter is the best medicine. Well, you know. That. I'm literally your drug. You know that. Oh, we don't fit. <laughs> there we go. Um, you know, whenever Tia comes over, okay. it's like, okay. it's awesome. <laughs> so, yeah. So, yeah, you guys haven't seen her since the whole starting school thing. Yeah. She's graduated now. <laughs> God, I look like hell. Um, she's graduated now, and she's looking for a job. And we had a couple connections, so she sent out a resume, and we're just waiting to hear. So, yeah. <laughs> yeah. So, who knows? She might be in Alaska. <laughs> I guess it's not in Alaska. No. The guy told us it was in Alaska, but it's not in Alaska. It's in Alberta or something. But anyway. Um, yeah, so she's here. My baby's here. Hi. She's going to be my bitch for the next <laughs> couple of weeks. <laughs> so Are we forgetting that if you treat me wrong, I will not take care of you? <laughs> <laughs> well, hmm. you need when, me. when do I not treat you well? Give me a break. Two seconds uh, ago. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, um, so George is off the hook. And he can now focus on work and... Uh, and Teal will do the rest. Hopefully. I made dinner. She made an awesome dinner last night. It was actually the first dinner, first meal that I've had since the surgery that Shh, I could actually tell George eat. George that I'm better. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, I mean, I haven't been able to eat anything because my throat's been really sore. My throat's starting to get better. And so I ate last night. 
but oh my god the aftermath was pretty nasty it was like your stomach didn't know what was happening i know right what is this food get it out oh my god i have never heard such a commotion in my stomach in my life it was like you know tectonic plates crashing into each other and the rumble of of lava and that it was mean and nasty and it mm -mm. It, it, it did not want to be in my body i don't know the gas oh my god george says that's it you're staying out in the living room <laughs> and i was like i'm sorry i can't control it right so uh, boy do I look semi-human? <laughs> no. <laughs> um, yeah, so it, it was a bit of a, a bit of a last night. Uh, I feel a lot better today. <laughs> so, but it was really good. It was really good. And uh, it. I guess I should tell you what it was. I don't even know what it was. <laughs> It was like a beef stroganoff. Not really. Sort of. But yeah, it was like... My you know, way of thinking is that it's like a normal spaghetti, but with white sauce. Yeah, it was mushroom sauce. Yeah. If you put like actual tomato sauce, it would have been just like a normal uh, pasta. <laughs> <whoa. laughs> Beep! <laughs> okay, I'm going to have to like... Yeah. You got to censor me. Anytime you videotape with me. Yeah, apparently. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, so anyway, it was really good. So, um, I think food, getting food into my system is going to also help with my healing and everything. And oh my God, all the messages that I'm getting from you guys. Oh, you're all saying, you know, keep on top of your meds. I'm trying to do that. It would help if you had some. <laughs> if I had some. Um, you know, keep my foot up. Well, I have a myriad of pillows happening here. <laughs> like, <laughs> it's like I don't think my foot could be up any friggin' further. Um... And then, you know, you're saying, oh, don't do too much. Well, this is pretty much all I'm doing. Oh, whoa. Boobage. <laughs> okay, let's just, like, tuck those puppies in. I will uh, say, though, like, for someone who just got out of surgery, you do move around pretty well. I'm trying. But, I, man, it hurts like a mother. It's, I mean, as soon as I put my foot down... The throbbing is horrendous, and and I still get that that shooting pain across my foot like a machete is taken off my toes. I don't get it. Why would you elevate your foot? Because then all the blood's going to go down, so once you put your foot down, the blood's going to rush through to your foot. I know. Don't you need the blood to heal your foot? N well, no. <laughs> if you keep your foot elevated above your heart... Yeah. It, the blood goes out and it lessens the pain, right? But yeah, as soon as you put your foot down, it's going to hurt. <laughs> and it's going to hurt bad. It's like this waterfall of blood rushing to your foot and everything just all of a sudden magnifies. Huge. That's dumb. Yeah, but it feels great when your foot's up. <laughs> So of course I've got to I've got to put my foot down real slow and I got to wait for all the blood to rush back to it and then I have to cringe and pain and and wait for it to subside a little bit so that I can get up on my scooter and then go off in the house and do what I you know go to the bathroom and come back. <laughs> That's about the extent of what I can do. Um I I do get my coffee in the morning but it's it's a hassle, and it's a chore, and it's painful. Just saying. So. Um, I am now done with my blood thinners. 
but I have to take, oh, oh yeah, we gave me the, the last shot today. <laughs> um, starting tomorrow, I guess, to take an aspirin twice a day. And then I do that until the 18th when I see my surgeon. And then I guess I'm done with that or something. But, um, yeah, so Tia will be coming with me to my doctor's appointment. So she'll be able to film what's going on. <laughs> so that will be fun. We'll all get to see my foot at the same time. And how you get downstairs. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, you'll film how I... <laughs> <laughs> that should be fun. Uh, the dog will actually get some outside time. If it stops raining. If it stops raining. It's been pouring rain for a couple of days. But uh, Bailey's happy as hell that she actually got to go for a car ride with Tia. <laughs> she came in the house and had the zoomies. She was so happy. So, <clears throat> but now she's tuckered out. <laughs> It's just, yeah. <laughs> so, uh, yeah. Um, crocheting. I'm I'm trying to get some crocheting done. I'm still working on my rectangular shawl thing, but it's slow going because I keep messing up and I have to frog it. Good drugs. <laughs> Uh, what else? Okay. I've been trying to get caught up on videos, but this last couple of days has been a little bit of a, um, a little harder. So I haven't been able to watch many videos. I just watched Lisa from Lisa's Crochet and she mentioned something about Madonna and her computer. I missed that. I don't know what's going on. And then I just saw a thing pop up from Madonna saying, I'm here. So I have to go and watch that video. Find out, apparently her computer's crashed or gone or something. She needs a new one. And I've been missing the lives. But apparently on Granny D's live, uh, there was word going around something about a GoFundMe to get Madonna a new computer. Count me in. Um, <clears throat> so anyways, uh... We gotta get on that. We gotta save save Madonna. <laughs> um, yeah. Uh, what else? I've got. Oh, um, you know that pattern that's been going around about the baby Yoda, and how Disney contacted her and basically slapped her hand and said you can't do that. Copyrights. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Copyright stuff. Me. Don't judge you. Um, with copyright stuff, right? Apparently, well, not apparently. I noticed that Yolanda Lopez, uh, Soda Lopez, sorry, um, just put out a baby Yoda Amigurumi. It's been out now for two days, I think. I haven't heard anything as to whether or not she's going to get slapped as well. But if she doesn't get over there, like, real quick, it's really cute. It's like a little ball. It's almost like a little Christmas ornament, and it's got a baby Yoda inside. It's so, it's so cute. So if you do Amigurumi, hop on over to her channel and get the pattern while it's there. I don't do Amigurumi, so. And I haven't seen the new Star Wars, so. But for those of you that do, get on over there. Um, I'll leave that link down below as well. <laughs> Jane from Scraptastic Yarns. I did see her, not her latest video yet, but the video before that or whatever. <laughs> she went on a yarn haul and she was talking about this yarn and she was groping her yarn and feeling it, smelling it, and it was almost x rated. It That's was so weird. It was hilarious. <laughs> I mean, I almost had to ch ch shut my camera off or shut my my video off because I was just like, whoa, whoa, whoa. Yeah. <laughs> oh, hi, Bella. <laughs> it was like, whoa, Jane, <laughs> do you need a minute? <laughs> I was, oh, it was hilarious, though. 
<laughs> so yeah, it was, it was quite comical. So I just thought I'd tell you my thoughts on that. <laughs> um, okay, also Lisa from Lisa's Crochet put out a call out, um, which I'm so thankful for. Um, she put a call out to everybody to, because apparently Billy's having issues with um, not getting any hats for kids lately and she's really running low. So Lisa had said what she'd like everybody to do is come and buy my pattern for my Scooty uh, and make the pattern for kids and send it out to Billy. Thank you so much, Lisa. That's just a wonderful, wonderful thought and idea. Um, the pattern is for adults, but you can modify it for children. Um, if you have any issues with trying to figure that out, just contact me and I will help you through it. Uh, you just do less rows um, and whatnot. So, uh, yeah, I think it's a great idea. Um, but I'm going to, I've got a few hats that I'm going to send out to Billy. Not Scooty Patterns uh, hats, but hats that I had from before. And I've been sitting on them for a while now and I just haven't got them out. So yeah, so if you're interested in doing that, my link is down below for my Etsy page. Um, any of my patterns that are on my Etsy page can be made for children. So um, yeah, so that would be great if we can help out Billy. Um, and Billy, thank you for the pep talk. Uh, <laughs> I found myself going, yes, mom. <laughs> uh, you know, but um, I am trying really hard to take your advice. It has been tough. Um, I'm finding that, like, I've got a few things I need to do. Like, I've got to send out a couple of packages for the Name the Scooty contest that I did scooter. or scoot 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 like a <laughs> yeah <laughs> scooter <laughs> name the scooter contest that I did I still have to get that stuff sent out um <clears throat> but she can help me <laughs> so um I'm also going to send her out today to check my PO box because apparently I'm gonna send me out like I'm you're Aaron, bitch. Yes, <laughs> I am. That's why you're here, isn't it? Give me some gas and I'm, I'm going. <laughs> <laughs> I'll go wherever you want me to go. <laughs> <laughs> well, I had lots of gas yesterday. <laughs> <laughs> Those kind of fumes don't work. <laughs> God, can you imagine if you bottled that shit? Man. And, and it worked? Wow. We can save the world with that. <laughs> no. <laughs> anyway. I didn't tell you. This is fine. I woke up in my sleep because I farted and it scared me. <laughs> <laughs> like it woke me up. <laughs> what? <laughs> it happened twice. And now that's all over YouTube. I'm okay with that. <laughs> um, I'm doing okay. Once I get my pills tomorrow, I'll be doing even better. This, this here is just not a good look. I, <laughs> I'm, I'm red and I'm blotchy and I, this is just not a good look for me. Oh my God. I look like hell. So. <sighs> You look nice and tanned. I'm like, I look like I'm old and weathered and drug, so, drug, drug me through the dirt. <laughs> oh, anyway. All right. So I will talk to you guys later. And like I said, if I have anything else. Oh, wow. Duh. I knew there was something else I needed to talk to you guys about. <clears throat> Niagara Falls, April. It's literally on your paper. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it is too. <laughs> wow. Wow. Um, 
for all of you that are going to Niagara Falls in April to do the Nona Stitching Lounge gathering, <clears throat> um, I am going. Uh, Tia might be coming with me. George is not coming with me. Um, the issue that I have come up with is that if I'm going into the Toronto airport, I forget the name of it, um, it's an hour and a half drive to the hotel and they don't have shuttle service. Yeah. So let's hope I can go. <laughs> yeah, if Tia goes with me, then that's great. Then we can rent a car and it's all golden. If not, I'm trying to figure out how I'm going to get to the hotel. Um, Isla from Brown Owl said that she's going to be renting a car and that she could take me. But the issue is, is that if her flight is different than mine and we don't connect, I don't want her sitting at the airport for all that time waiting for me and vice versa because I'm, I'm not sure. I'm going to be starting to wait bear in April, like wait bear on my foot. Um, that's not a lot of time for me to figure out how to walk. <laughs> so, uh, I don't know. I don't know what's going to happen. I might be in a wheelchair for all I know. Um, I'm going to go to the travel agent and I'm going to find out how I can get this all worked out. But if you guys are flying in to the airport and you know how you get into the hotel, Give me some advice because I don't know that area at all. Uh, Sandy from left is right is going. I don't know if she's flying in or if she's going to be driving. Um, and she's she's in a scooter. So I don't know how she's going to be traveling. But anyways, um, so if you guys have any advice for me, please let me know. Uh, and yeah, help a girl out. <laughs> so um okay so i will talk to you guys later i love you all thank you so much for all your well wishes and keep it coming um i love getting emails from you guys i don't care how long they are it's just it makes my day go by so much easier tell her how pretty she is oh. <laughs> <laughs> i know i don't look good at all but you know it's 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 like that right now. That's okay. Your side profile looks pretty good. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I'm going. <laughs> I have to have a shower today. All right. I'll talk to you guys later. Mwah. Bye. Bye.